A little bit more to go. This would be the erector spinae muscles. And again, you don't have to know the individual ones. Just call them as a group, the erector spinae. And then from this view, this is latissimus dorsi, like we saw before. This muscle that sort of triangular that flips over top of the latissimus dorsi is spinotrapezius. And then as you move upwards, this would be a chromiotrapezius. And then upwards a little bit more, this would be clavotrapezius. So the tre three trapezius muscles, spinotrapezius, the chromiotrapezius, and clavotrapezius. And likewise, you have the same thing with the deltoid muscles. So you have spinodeltoid, the chromiodeltoid, and clavodeltoid. So both of those are in the same order. Clavo, trapezius, clavodeltoid, the chromiotrapezius, the chromiodeltoid, spinotrapezius, and spinodeltoid. And if we look back, the acromiotrapezius, underneath it is the supraspinatus. And you can kind of see in here the spine of the scapula that goes down here. So if we kind of pull this out a little bit, you can see the side of the spine right here. This would be the infraspinatus. So supraspinatus, infraspinatus. And then the muscle you see separated right here would be teres major. Since we have it sort of in this direction here, um, again, this is just lifting up latissimus dorsi. This was the teres major that I showed you a little bit ago. And this one that comes over here, can you all see this one right here? That's rhomboidius major. Okay, so teres major, rhomboidius major. And that's all under the latissimus dorsi. So going up here between the shoulder blades, hold those legs in there. Okay. These would be the rhomboid minors. This one that comes up here sort of individually, this strong band here, is rhomboidius capitis. And then the flat one that lies underneath rhomboidius capitis, so like right in here, would be splenius. And subscapularis would be this muscle in here. So underneath the scapula, subscapularis. One other one I forgot to mention here in the um, upper shoulder. Again, I said this was a chromiotrapezius. And this is spinodeltoid. This muscle right in here is levator scapulae ventralis. And as we move down the upper arm, again, the chromiodeltoid and clavodeltoid. This would be the triceps brachii lateral head, triceps brachii long head. And the muscle sort of between clavodeltoid and the triceps lateral head, if you see this muscle like right in here, that's brachialis. And this one's a little mangled. I mean, it's actually cut here at the end. But if you see this muscle right here, it should come up and connect onto here. That would be the brachioradialis. Again, that's just the most superficial muscle you'll find there in the lower arm. Okay. 